Hey everyone, welcome back to another S15 200SX Resto Mod video. I have managed to find some really, really interesting seats. So really excited to be getting these in. You can see them in the background there, but we'll give the interior a proper clean as well. Since we've got the car, we haven't done that just yet, but check out these seats. They're absolutely awesome. And they're in much better condition than the ones that we've got in there, which are an interesting two-tone sort of variant. And let's have a closer look at them now. So from the back, they look very similar to the stock seats, but looking at them, from the front, you can see that they're a half sort of um, Alcantara with an orange trim underneath. The stitching is orange. It looks like bright red even. And they look so, 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 so good. Best thing about these are that they're gonna be one, much more comfortable and also will keep you in the seat much, much better than any leather seat ever would. The replacement seats didn't come with this seat belt here, so I'm just gonna have to bring that over from the other seat and just give it a bit of a clean up because that button is a little bit gross. You may have already named them, but if you've not already recognized it, these are the super rare Ortec seats, which feature a perforated suede fabric with bright orange backing and contrast stitching. The Ortec S15s were the high-powered, naturally aspirated versions of the S15 with 197 brake horsepower or 147 kilowatts thanks to the free-flowing exhaust with tubular headers, a more freer-flowing intake, a higher compression ratio, and more aggressive cams. Some forums state that these seats are the final edition and only found on late model S15 Spec R, but wherever you search, everyone does agree they're a very rare option. Out of the 43,000 S15s made, there were only around 1,800 Ortec versions built. And so these interiors are actually really, really rare. You would have also seen the blue and orange suede interiors known as Type B, which are also very rare. While you're taking a closer look, let me know in the comments below what you think of these seats. Are they a worthwhile purchase? So let's just take a moment to see how nice these are. So they're pretty awesome. Nice and clean, super lucky to have gotten these. You can see that there's that lovely um, perforated look and there's like a bright orange fabric behind there. And then you've got the bright red stitching there. I would even say that's bright orange stitching going across the fabric into the seat. Now, these are really, really cool because they actually do integrate into the interior itself. So the other fabric on the headrests and on the side bolsters, uh, they are definitely matching to the rear of the car. So the OEM trim, uh, these fit nicely into. In an ideal situation, I really do think that a retrim of the rear bucket seats would be the best thing to do. But, you know, for now, some wet patches there because I've just um, brushed them down. For now, they are a good match to the rear buckets. And you can see here exactly the fabric is like for like. <laughs> on the side bolsters there of these Ortec seats. So the seats are in and I've got to say they are a lot more comfortable than the other two-toned ones. And yes, as you might have guessed it already, they are the really rare Ortec versions of these seats. So what makes them special? You can see that their trim level is a little bit different, but they still do nicely integrate into the rest of the interior with the same fabric as the rear bucket seats. Now, I guess the only thing is now to try and find the matching door card trims. So with the Spec R door cards, they're just that regular gray perforated leather. But now with these Ortec uh, seats, you can see that there's that 
really orange perforation going on. It'd be really nice to have that here on the door cards as well. I believe that you can get them. It's just a matter of sourcing them, which I think is going to be a little bit impossible. So if anyone knows where to get those door cards from in that special fabric, that would be really good. Definitely let me know. Before you go, remember to like and subscribe. Let me know in the comments below what you think of these seats. Are they a worthwhile purchase or would you rather the orange and blue type B seats or would you keep things OEM?